Continuing on with the uh, review, you have a table here. It asks, it gives you four functions and it asks you to match the uh, function with the table. A couple of things that I'm going to do is I'm going to first notice that this is linear and this is linear. And so I'm going to check minus 10 plus 4 plus 15. Um, and then these are all going up by one, so it is not linear. And then I'm going to pick this one because it's positive, and I'm going to plug in two. So it's four times four plus eight plus one, and that is 16, 24, 25. Two times, ooh, two times, ah, two times two, that's four. 16, 20, that's 21, but then if I subtracted 1, it would be 19, so it is this one, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in here and I'm going to check this value also, so that's 4 times 9 plus 18 minus 1, 36 plus 18 minus 1, oh, did I do that right? Yeah. Did it again. That's two. That's six. That's six. That's 42 minus one is 41. So I used the positives and it worked with uh, H. The graph of an exponential function is shown on the grid, which dash line. So if I'm, this is my exponential, which one is an asymptote? It is this one, which is at y equals uh, 0, which is line s. And it uh, it's asking, do you know what an asymptote is? And that all exponential graphs have asymptotes, which means they get closer and closer, but never get to 0. Total number of seats in an auditorium is modeled by where x represents the number of rows of seats. How many rows if it has a total of 416 seats? 